You hate ads, I hate ads. You know what I like? Patreon.com slash Inkdependence keeps this channel ad free. Hello folks, welcome to Ink Dependence. I'm Mike, and this is a favorites video where I page through my Colo decks. This is a Rolo Dex full of colors. Find my top five out of one of these subcategories and then present them to you in no particular order. So here today we have pink purples. All right, first up we have Lamy Crystal Burl. This is a beautiful pinkish purple. I've actually had it in this pin right here, this Diplomat Arrow. Ever since I got it, uh, this arrow was a gift from a friend. So thank you very much, kind friend who sent this to me. I love it, and I really like this ink in there. And this has a really cool nib as well. It's a Bacchus Predator Extreme on here. And look how it shows off the different dimensions of this ink. Uh, from sheeniness to shadiness, it is gorgeous. Next up, Aurora Purple. Aurora, best known for like Aurora Black, say, has got some really nice colors. and. A Aurora Purple is one of those. It is a pinkish purple. Totally worth checking out. Next up, another pen, another, another ink that I've had in a pen since I got this ink. This is Diamine Jingleberry, uh, which was in the ink vent this, ink vent this year. And I tell you, I've had it in this Rotring 600 ever since. I just keep refilling it. It's that good. So Diamine Jingleberry, gorgeous ink. Uh, next up, Monteverde Purple Rain. This is a longtime favorite from a lot of folks and a different sort of pinkish purple. Pinkish purple comes in a lot of different shades and uh, this is definitely a pinkish purple even if it's a very different kind of pinkish purple. Monteverde Crystal Rain. And then lastly, Sailor Ink Studio number 435, a darker pinkish purple, but also like a totally different color from all the rest of these, right? It's kind of kind of a half step in between this range of pinkish purple and down to this one. And there is one honorable mention in this category, so let's take a look at that one. This is David Oscarson's 15th anniversary royal purple. I got this from a friend, my friend Greg. Just a sample. I don't have a bottle of this. I don't think you can get a bottle of this, which is why it is an honorable mention and not in the main lineup because... It's unobtainable. You just, I don't think you can get it. I don't know who made it for him. I don't know where you would possibly find it, but boy, is that a gorgeous pinkish purple. There you go. That's pink purples. Thanks for watching. Uh, let me know your favorite pink purples down below. And uh, until next time, Brahe.